Richard. Hi everyone. Yeah. Congratulations on on this new project. Now, yung first question ko ay para kay Donny. Hi Donny, good afternoon. Good afternoon of course, po. Donny, we've we've known your I don't know, your mother, si Miss Marisa Lax, as one of the best actresses here in the Philippines. And now you're landing uh, a lead role in this in this project. Ano yung mga advice o tips na binigay sa iyo ni Miss Maricel? Um, si Mommy kasi sobrang supportive lang niya, alam mo 'yun. Parang sorry, may nag may nagsasalita. <laughs> um, she's she's just very supportive, you know. She always gives me advice. I think the biggest one is to just focus. Um, sometimes kasi you know, there's so many things that can get in your way that, you know, you have to juggle a lot of things, especially in showbiz, and daming kailangan isipan, uh, pag-isipan, and of course, I'm still studying, and it's it's more of just siguro, ano, time management and being organized. Because sometimes, medyo ano ako eh, medyo lazy din. Parang ayaw kong gawin yung kailangan kong gawin. So, ayun, and then of course, sa mga lines, she helps me read them, and she tells me like, Uh, some advice on like how I can probably say this better. Um, we like watching mm. movies together and stuff like that. But she doesn't really make me pressured. Eh? Kasi she really just wants me to learn as well. Not on my own, but like mm. from the ones who are there with me as well. So it's very chill. Wow. Ay, yan, nabanggit yeah. mo na yung pressure, no? Um sa status mo ngayon, may nararamdaman ka pa rin bang pressure on your part being, of course, a pangilinan and, and of course, your mother din is from a famous showbiz clan. Yeah, I'm always asked this. I, I do say there's some sort of pressure but I don't really think I let it get to me um, because mas lalo ko mapapressure kung mafe-feel mo yung parang mga expectation ng mga tao. I just try to focus, you know, on my craft. Um, just, doing the best I can, learning as much as I can. And yun lang. Um, I think it's good pressure just to be motivated to you know, give my best and provide like the best we can for those who will watch the fans and those waiting for the series. Yeah. Thank you so much, Doni. And your last question ko is for Bell. Hi, Bell. Good afternoon. Hi, Sir Ron. Hello, Pogla. Of course, Bell. Um... Na natutukan ka namin ay nasubaybayan ka namin from being a child star and now a teen star na no. Would you consider this project as your break away from from the awkward stage? Kasi 'di ba normally sa showbiz kapag nagsimula bilang child star may awkward stage talaga. Yes. Ikaw ba um sa palagay mo ito na yung magwawala o magpapakawala sa iyo doon sa awkward stage na yon? Well, ako naman po, feeling ko po nalampasan ko na po yung awkward stage um, after I graduated from going bulilit. Kasi, you know, there's um, there, there's a space po talaga na um, parang nagmamature ka um, physically and emotionally. So, feeling ko nalagpasan ko na po yun. And, um, yeah, yun po. <laughs> and this this role makes you more mature, kumbaga. Yeah. Hopefully po, <laughs> yes. Ayan. Thank you so much, Bell. Thank you so much, everyone. Thank you, Richard. Keep safe. All right. Thank you so much, Vaughn. Um, next up, we have naman from James Miguel of Showbiz Ganap. Hello, James. Are you there? Ah, yes, po. Hello. Sorry. Hi, James. Hello, po. Hi. Um, yung question ko for... Um, Donnie and Bell. Um, kasi since nagpo-promote kayo madalas ngayon um, and lagi kayo magkasama, parang gano'n nakaralim yung friendship nyo together? Or parang outside work na? Um, um, compared ano to sa first time... Sorry. Go ahead, Bell. <laughs> Ay, eh, sige, sige. Compared to sa first time na nag-shoot kami... Um, there was still awkwardness, not just with Donnie and I, but with the whole cast. But eventually, after you know being with them for um quite um a time, naging close kami. Feeling ko mas naggrow yung relationship ng lahat. 
feeling ko rin ganun. Hindi na mawawala yung friendship na nabuo namin dito. Pamilya na talaga eh. So, yeah, of course. Of course, when you're um, spending time with each other this much, when you when you're locked in, you know, which I really love, it becomes, yes, it's still work, but it it becomes less of work, but more of, parang, wala, kasama mo lang pamilya mo, kasama mo lang yung, yung mga gusto mo makatrabaho. So, we really enjoyed. We all really got close. Of course, si Bell, mas naging close kami. Um, ayun po. I would say, it's it's very genuine. Um, masasabi ni ba na parang, on go, papunta na sa best friend level yung friendship niyo? Pwede. Pwede naman. Yeah. Yeah. Ayun lang. Sorry. Thank you. Ay, okay. All right. Thanks, Thank James. you so much. <laughs> Thank you so much, James. Pero guys, uh, bigo, before we go to the next media question, I, I personally have a couple of questions for you guys then. I mean, anyone can answer this. How excited are you guys to fact that to see something so big? I mean, it's such a big collaboration, no? And then between three um, ABS event, um, under ABS event, was, how excited are you to see that it's finally coming and it's going to be air worldwide? Sabay sabay ba? You, anyone can start. Super excited po, <laughs> Richard. Hi, Barbara. Kung ako te, ako na lang ah. <laughs> Super excited po, and uh, it's been two years nga po yung making ng He's Into Her, and and dami pong nag-aabang talaga. Kahit pati kami talaga sobrang nag-aabang na may papalabas sa siya, and a week to go na lang. Yan. Ayan, excited na excited. Sino pa dito? Si Kauri, parang may sagot ka dyan. <laughs> <laughs> guys, namiss ko kayo lahat. Hindi yung mga kasama ko lang po dito. Actually, namiss ko kayo lahat, guys. Pero ayun, super duper excited din ako. Kasi almost two years din namin itong pinagahandaan. And finally, lalabas na siya. So, ayun. Kuya Richard, nood ka din ah. Supportahan mo din. For sure, for sure. <laughs> Sige, let's go for two more. Two more. Kaya, sino sasagot dito? Ano? Mag-choose pa ba ako talaga? Boys naman. Si Limer Jeremiah. lang po. Nag-message po siya sa akin ngayon. lang bro kasi ako, shy type yung mga yan eh. Kunyari siya. Well, Richard, uh, sobrang excited kami kasi ginawa namin to almost two years, no? And um, sobrang sobrang excited ng fans na nakakaawa na basta di ko ma-explain. <laughs> Walang word for excitement. Mas mataas pa sa excitement. May kasama may kasamang gratefulness. Sige na, ako na po magsasalita. Ako na po magsasalita, Krisa, para masaya ka. Bilang ang sexy mo today. <laughs> uh, sobrang excited din po because this is a very big event. Imagine, um, ABS-CBN Entertainment, Star Cinema, and I Want TFC talagang nag-collab for this huge, for this huge um, I Want series. Grabe. Yes. Di ba? Oh, okay ba, Chris, ha? Talaga na isingit mo ba na ilaban mo pa rin talaga yan eh. <laughs> Ayan, next, I think, Belle. Belle, you want to share also? Yes, actually, I was scrolling through Twitter earlier nga po and I saw one tweet na eight days na lang mapapanood na he's into her and I'm just overwhelmed with my emotions. I don't know what to feel. I'm nervous but because of the expectations and yun na po, it's such a big collaboration between ABS, CBN Entertainment. Um, uh, yun nga po, sobrang nervous but at the same time, more of that, I feel very, very excited because we've been waiting for this moment for two years and yun, and I know we did our best here and yun, I'm really excited for everyone to see this. Yeah, very, very nice. I mean, I, I, I love how this, this, you guys really all have this, I don't know, this connection, this friendship there. Because if there's one that's written, everyone starts speaking. Na. It's just like, I don't know, it's high school. Talaga. <laughs> <laughs> all right, then, of course, we got to ask the cast. So maybe we can ask the, man, um, the director, the writer, or of course, the author. Kayo po, do you guys have anything you guys want to say? Yes, uh, ako, I just want to say uh, yeah, thank you so much po sa patience. Uh, ito na po, last eight days. Um, and um, 
sobrang un, uh, unreal nung pakiramdam lang na ito nga, eight days na lang talaga lalabas na tayo. And um, excited na ako mapasaya, mapasaya kayo lahat. And, Direk, how was working with everyone here? <laughs> <laughs> sobrang saya naman. Yun nga, um, sabi ko na sa kanila na hin- what we built on set and off set, dapat um, hin- we, we should bring it onwards. Hindi siya pwedeng shooting friends lang tayo. Kasi meron kang kasing ganang term ng pag... Diba? Magkakaibig ka kayo pero sa set lang. Pero pag offset parang walang nangyayari. Eh, eh, eh yung pinaka-ayo ko eh. Parang, what y- eh, diba? Doon mo malalaman kung gano'n ka genuine yung na-build nyo on set. If you, even after the show or the taping, you still have that bond. And that's when you truly know that it's genuine. That is so true, Drek. I mean, I mean, honestly, in this short interaction that we're having right now, I can see how close all these, um, everyone here is already. Like, it's just so cute watching you guys. Yeah. And um, to our head writer, of course, do you have anything you want to share? Uh, okay. um, we just finished editing the first episode. Uh, we're basically ready to go with the first episode. Um, and when I saw it, I was, my heart really swelled with pride. Uh, not just for direct chat because this is like his first major project but for all of them when, whenever i would see them on screen because um it's like being witness to to a plant <laughs> to a flower blossoming you know and so it's seeing them grow with being witness to their to their growth and um i hope they enjoy it as much as we enjoyed it because it's it's really a big deal for us Uh, isang linggo na kaming walang tulog ni Direk, <laughs> kaka-edit, and kakaayos ng lahat. And it's so exciting. Um, and I'm also thinking of our audience. I think they've been waiting now for a while, ever since this whole pandemic started, uh, that they they're, they're able to watch something that's very feel-good and um, something that would uplift them through all of these, no? all of these problems that we have. And I think when they watch the first episode, that's how they'll feel, no? kahit uh, hindi na sila teenager, kikiligin sila, diba? Pag mga, na-imagine ko na nga eh, sinasabi namin ni Chad, na-imagine namin, like, lalo na sa last scene ng episode 1, feeling namin yung mga fans, tipo, nagsasabunutan na, kung magkakatabi lang sila, kasi baka imposible magkakatabi yung fans ha, pag pinalabas siya sa May 28, na feeling namin, nagsisigawan silang lahat sa kilig, nagpapaluan. Hindi yung si Van na, ano? The ano, yes. The ano doon. <laughs> the ano doon. <laughs> the ano. The ano. Oh, the ano. Kaya nga. Oh. And I'm so proud of them. Wala, ang mga artista namin, dalawang taon ng tinatabaho to, pero never nag-leak ng kahit na anong spoiler. So, basta intayin nyo na lang. Sobrang kilig nung episode one. And I'm really hoping after that, talaga sasabihin nila, eh, hey, oo nga, worth watching yung palabas and worth following all of these young people in front of us right now because uh, they're good actors and um, not only are they good actors, they're good people. So they're deserving of all the support that they're getting now, Richard. Yun lang. Yay! Thank you so much, uh, Miss Van, for, for sharing. And of course, to the author of He's Into Her, how was it to see something that you imagined no. come into real life? I think that's what most, if not all, the authors dream, no? To, some, to see it become reality. Uh, of course, sobrang saya talaga. Kasi, uh, yun nga, dream come true talaga siya. Uh, hindi ko rin kasi ine-expect yung ganitong kalaking project talaga and effort na ibibigay nila doon sa He's Into Her. As in, talagang nalagpasan yung expectations ko doon sa series. Na, um, supposedly kasi talagang for I want siya eh, Yung proposal sa akin for I want. Pero, ang binigay nila sa akin pati sa sa ano sa Kapamilya Channel, Kapamilya Online Live, sa A to Z Channel 11 at saka sa TFC tapos mapapanood siya worldwide. Kaya as in talagang dream come true siya. Tapos yung cinematography as in sobrang ganda. And ang pinaka nagustuhan ko talaga ngayon kasi last night naglabas si Star Cinema sa ABS-CBN at saka si I Want ng panibagong teaser. Tapos, as in, uh, kumuha ako ng time para basahin yung comments. Uh, naaalala ko kasi two years ago yung mga comments, most of them talagang 
hate comments, negative comments, ganyan. Pero yung kagabi, as in nakaka-happy kasi talagang lahat ng comments, hindi man lahat or most, uh, karamihan dun sa comments, as in positive talaga. Kaya sobrang nakakatuwa. Ayun po, nakakadagdag siya sa excitement. I love it. I love it. I think honestly like just just the thought of something sa imagination that was naging totoong buhay. I'm like wow, that is just brilliant. Okay, guys. So, enough ma enough na sa mga tanong ko. I guess now we have to turn it over back to our media. And we got a question from um Neil Ramos, actually two questions. Neil Ramos of Tempo, but I think uh, may technical difficulty siya. So, ako na lang yung tatanong ng question. So, this question is for Donny. What do you like most about Bell? This question is not from me, ah, from from Neil Delaga. I promise. <laughs> Neil, wherever you are in the world, um, what I like most about Belle, she's very determined in her craft and very hardworking and very supportive. 